right, guys, we're doing our final game of the night where we have time to do a fourth game. All right, Nels, a number between 1 and 52 again. Um, I think you already know 21. He's sticking with 21. Wait a minute, let me uh, get this together. All right, and AJ is playing again. He's number one on the leaderboard. He's playing on trying to approve his run total. Um, a number between 1 and 52, AJ. Uh, 32. Going 32. And... This is our last game on tonight. And this is Nell's. If Nels win this game, this will be his fourth win. Five wins will get you a $25,000 bonus. And we have AJ. All right. And the under nose jackpot is $17,000 for anyone who gets it. Let's get going. And this is your question, AJ. All right. Oh, excuse me, not AJ. I'm sorry about that. Nels is a champ, so this is Nels' question. Right. Nels. We asked 100 psychiatrists if a person wanted to keep from going to jail, could he fool a psychiatrist into thinking he's crazy? How many psychiatrists said yes, he can fool a psychiatrist into thinking he's crazy? I'm going to go 36 on this. What's your number? 36. He's going 36. All right. Is it higher or lower than 36, AJ? Can you repeat the question again? Yes, sir. We asked one of the psychiatrists if a person wanted to keep from going to jail, could he fool a psychiatrist into thinking he's crazy? How many psychiatrists said yes? And eight, and uh, Nell said 36. I'll say higher. Going higher. Okay, let's check it out. The actual number of psychiatrists that said yes, um, a per if a person wanted to keep from going to jail, could he fool the psychiatrist into thinking he's crazy. Let's see what the answer is. 58. It is higher. Nicely done, AJ. AJ, you have a jack showing. I'll go lower. Okay. He's keeping the jack lower than jack. It's a six. I'll freeze. Freezing on the six. Keeping Nels away from his cards. This is your question, AJ. AJ, we asked 100 marriage counselors. Do you think most 21-year-old men are mature enough for marriage? How many marriage counselors said most 21-year-old men are mature enough for marriage? I'll say 29. Going 29, okay. Nels, is it higher or lower than 29? I'm going a teeny bit higher. He's going a teeny bit higher. Okay. All right. The actual number of marriage counselors that said most 21-year-old men are mature enough to handle marriage is 14 is not higher, is lower. So, uh, AJ, you get it, and you have a six showing. Can I change the card? Yes, sir. You won the question. The six becomes an eight. Ooh. Ooh. I'll go lower. Lower than the eight. No, it's a queen. Sorry about that, AJ. Nels, you have a jack. Lower, please. Lower than a jack. No, it's a king. So the cards are getting rough. I see that. Yeah. Third yeah, question, are. and it goes to you, Nels. Nels, we asked 100 school bus drivers, is there one child... You absolutely dread seeing on the bus each morning. How many bus drivers say yes, there is one child that they dread seeing on their bus each morning, Nels? I'm going to say 55. Nels is saying 55. AJ, do you believe that number is higher or lower than 55? I think Nels might have gotten it on the nose. <laughs> You think so? He got it on the nose. Uh, you going lower, AJ? Yeah. Just for the heck of it, we'll see if he did get on the nose. The actual number of bus drivers that say yes, uh, that there is a child they absolutely dread to see each morning is 
66 it is not lower, it's higher. So yeah, he didn't get in the nose. Okay, nose, you have a jack showing. Keep the jingle lower. He's keeping the jack. Okay, lower than a jack. It's a 10. I'm gonna go higher. Ooh, higher than a 10. No, it's a five. I'm sorry. Yeah. Free chance to you, AJ. Lower. Okay, lower than an eight. It's a six. Freeze. Freezing on the six. Okay, and we on to the fourth and final question. Somebody must win on this play of the card, so control is critical, as you know. And this is your question, AJ. We ask wonder bartenders, when a customer returns a drink because it was the wrong order, do you ever serve it to someone else? How many bartenders admitted that they do serve it to someone else? I'll say 34. Going 34. Nels, is it higher or lower than 34? I'm going a tiny bit higher. A tiny bit higher indeed. Okay, let's check it out. The actual number of bartenders that said that they have admitted to serving a drink to someone else because it's the wrong order, order is 64 is a lot higher. All right, Nels, you have a jack. Okay, I'm going to pass it to AJ. I have to, oh. Now, I have to explain to the audience what you got to do, Nels. Okay. All right, he said he's passing it to AJ. Well, what I was going to say is Nels has the option to keep the card. If he wants to, he can change it. And he has four cards to go in order to win. And AJ has the six. He does not have the power to change it. And he has two cards to go. Now he said he does not want the control. So AJ, you have to be right on both cards. All right. I'll say higher. Higher than a six. No, Nels get game one. Woo. Okay, that's another $1,000 for Nels. He's at 27000 Eight hundred. We had another five hundred dollars to the on the nose jackpot. Is at seventeen thousand five hundred dollars. All right, and uh, we're doing game two, and we're gonna start game two with AJ. This game is worth two thousand dollars. Excuse me, not AJ Nels. All right, Nels. We surveyed one hundred married women, and we asked them. If your husband gave you a waffle iron for Valentine's Day, would you be pleased? How many women said they would be pleased, uh, Nels? I'm going to say 34. Nels says 34. Okay, is it higher or lower than 34, AJ? I'll say higher. Going higher. Okay, let's check it out. The actual number of women that said they would be pleased if they got a waffle iron from their husband for Valentine's Day is 43 is higher. Good job. Yeah, if you would have flipped those numbers over, he would have had the $17,500 jackpot. All right, AJ, you have a nine showing. Do you want to keep that nine or change it? I'll change it. Okay, the nine becomes a four. Higher. Higher than a four. It's an eight. Lower. Lower than an eight. It's an eight. Freeze. Freezing on the eight, keeping Nels away from his cards. And this is your question, AJ. AJ, we asked 100 women who have been married for 25 years or more, if you could, would you like to have a baby right now? How many women who have been married for at least 25 years said they would like to have a baby? I'll say 25. Going 25, okay. Nels, is it higher or lower than 25? I'm going to go higher. He's going higher. All right, let's check it out. The actual number of married women that has been married 25 years or more that said they would like to have a baby is... Only 12 is not higher, it is lower. All right, Nels, you have that H. I mean, excuse me, AJ, you have the 8 showing. Sorry about that. Uh, I'll change it. Okay, he's changing the 8. The 8 becomes a king. Lower. Lower than a king. Is a 2. Higher. 
for $2,000 higher than a two. Good job, AJ. So you're up to $2,000, AJ. Now we're going to our three card, three question showdown to see who's going to go under the money cards for $144,000. And the under and the knows, building. Yep. The under knows that cards at $18,000 now. And climbing. Okay. Here we go. And this question goes to Nels here. Nels, we asked 100 men, if you could prolong your life 20 years by having your brain transplanted into a woman's body, would you do it? How many men said they would? I'm going to go 50, right? Dead central 50. You're saying 50, okay. AJ, do you believe that number is higher or lower than 50? Lower. Say it again. Lower. Lower than 50. All right, let's check it out. The actual number of, um, of uh, men that said they would uh, transplant their brain into a woman's body is... 35, it is lower. Good job, AJ. AJ, we have a jack showing. Lower. Okay, lower than a jack. It's a 10. I'm risking it. Lower. To become the new champion, lower than a 10. No, it's a double. So it goes back to Nell's free chance. You have a 4. Higher. Higher than a 4. It's a 7. Higher. All right, this will be your fourth win in a row. Higher than a seven. Good job. You have won your fourth match. Woo, whoa. <laughs> that brings you up to $30,800 now, and we will talk to you in a minute. Well, AJ, you still number one on the leaderboard, but you have $2,000 here, and congratulations, AJ. All right. Good game, AJ. Wow. Nels, you finish each of those four games very quickly. Yes. And won all four matches. So you win one more match, you'll have a $25,000 bonus. I just want to say I wish him good luck in the last match, um, whatever that is. Yeah. It's going to be Monday, not tomorrow. Because I don't do Sundays. All right. All right, here we go. Are we going with 21 again, Nels? Yes, we are. All right. We'll put the 21 up here. And once the cards come up, we give you $1,000. And for $1,000, your first card is a six. I would like to change it with number two. He's changing it with number two. The six becomes... A king. All of it lower, please. Everything lower than a king. It's a jack. You have two thousand dollars in a jack. Let's go all of it lower again. Everything lower than a jack. There's a nine. You have four thousand dollars in a nine. Let's go fifteen hundred higher. Fifteen hundred dollars higher than a nine. No, it's a three. Well, you have $2,500. We bring you up to the second level. You have a thousand more dollars. You had 3500 and now you have a three. $2,000 higher. All right, $2,000. Higher than a three. It's a queen. $5,500 and a queen. All of it lower. Everything lower than a queen. It's a jack. Eleven thousand dollars in a jack. Let's go eight thousand lower. Woo! A big bet on a jack. Good luck, uh, Nels. Yeah. Eight thousand dollars lower than a jack. It's a four. Good job. You have nineteen thousand dollars now, Nels. The question is, are we keeping it? Yes. He is Let's not. Go. We'll keep before. Oh, my God. You have a... Uh, $12,000 higher. What's your bet? $12,000 higher. All right. Pretty big bet. As I said before, 
He, the minimum bet is $9,500. He's going with $12,000. This is for $31,000 or $7,000 if you're wrong. Higher than a four. Good job, yeah, $31,000. And now I think you're going to move on to the top um, four here. Yes. We had your previous winnings of $30,800. That gives you a total of $61,800. All right, guys, and that concludes these games of Card Sharks. And I will wet my whistle in a minute because we've been playing an hour and a half already. Four games went by very quickly. Um, those of y'all that want to join the um, YouTube Games and Entertainment group on on YouTube, any subscribers that want to join, let me know in the comments below. Let me have good comments, not trolling comments because if you troll on my channel, you will get reported because I had some troll comments on today. But any other comment is fine. This is Rodney1279 signing off saying be safe, be careful, take care everybody, and stay blessed. Goodbye, y'all. Here we go. And here we go.